Hello, good morning, students. Today we are going to start our new lesson that is area of trapezium and polygon. In this lesson, we have to find out the areas of various diagram which are in the form of trapezium or in the form of polygon. So, firstly, we are going to start with the area of trapezium. So, what is the formula for area of trapezium and which diagram we can say or which polygon we can say for trapezium? So, I have drawn one trapezium here. In trapezium, you must know that the one of its opposite side is parallel with each other. Like AB is parallel with BC. We can see in this diagram. So parallelogram kya hota hai? Jis mein ek pair uski opposite side ki parallel honi chahiye. Jis se AB parallel is CD ke saath. Thik hai? So how we can find out the area of trapezium? We have a formula. Formula is like this. Half into sum of the parallel side. Parallel side ki aapko sum yaha pe likhni hai. Into distance between them. Distance between them means height of the trapezium or altitude of an trapezium. The word can be used is height of the trapezium, altitude of an trapezium, or distance between them. Whichever word they use, you have to use that as a distance between them. So we will see some numerical based on this. From exercise 18a, I have taken a question: Find area of trapezium whose parallel sides are 24 cm. 20 cm and distance between them is 15 cm. Okay, so we have to use the question in the same way. We have to use the question. So, area of trapezium equals to what is the formula? Half into sum of the parallel side. The parallel side is what is the same? Whose parallel side is 24 and 20 means 24 plus 20 we will have to add. Because they have asked in uh, asked for some of the parts. Then distance between them. Distance between them is 15. So multiply by 15. From this equation, you already know that we have to solve first bracket. 24 plus 20. For, uh, what will be the answer? 44. And then multiply by 15. If you divide 44 by 2, 2 2 is 4, 2 2 is 4. 15 2 is 30. Remain 3, 15 to the 30 plus 3, 3, 333. 330 is the area. So, unit of area will be centimeter square because all the values have unit centimeter. So, area will be centimeter square in this case. I hope you have understood the question how I have solved the area of the magazine. So, now we will move forward and see. One more numerical from the same exercise, numerical number 7. It is a bit different and uh, we have to use some brain to solve this numerical. So I have taken this numerical to explain you. The numerical is like this. The area of trapezium 180 cm square. Means area is already given. Area of trapezium means area of trapezium equals to 180 centimeter square and height is 9 centimeter height of trapezium is given as 9 centimeter if one of the parallel side is longer than the other by 6 centimeter means the parallel side are not given directly they have given in the form of equation one of the parallel side is longer than other by 6 centimeter so what I will do I will consider the smaller side the x and larger side will be x plus 6. This is what you have to do with this one. This is the small value of the value of the swap x consider. So, I will write here that the smaller parallel side will be x. Then, larger side will be greater than greater than by 6. That means x plus 6. Okay. Now put this value in formula of area of trapezium. Area of trapezium equal to half into sum of parallel sides. Sum of parallel sides into height. Okay. Put the values in the Formula. Area of trapezium, I already know that its value is 180, then half into sum of parallel side, one side is x, 
and other side is x plus 6 means I will written here x plus x plus 6 x x plus 6 into height of the capacitor which is given as 9 ok so let's solve this I will take 9 into this direction and 2 also in the length of the equal to sign means the term which is in denominator will goes to goes to numerator and the term in numerator will goes to denominator x plus x is 2x plus 6 ok I will solve I will solve the remaining integral here uh, here you can divide 180 by 9 9 to the 18 9 0 the 9 so 20 to the 40 equal to 2x plus 6 6 will go into left then x so here value will be I will take 6 into the left that means 40 minus 6 equal to 2x 40 minus 6 is 34 so 34 equal to 2x then 2 will go in the denominator that means x is equal to 34 by 2 which will equal to 17 centimeter ok and then if you put this uh, in the previous in this equation that is x plus 6 means the larger side will be x plus 6 that means 16 plus 6 and it will be 23 centimeter so in the then in the last you can write down the statement the two parallel side will be 17 centimeter and 23 centimeter respectively.